What's up people, my name is Ahmed and welcome back to yet another video. Today, I want to talk to you about this Korean drama that I watched that I absolutely love. It's called The Uncanny Counter. Why would I recommend you watch this show? There are three reasons. Well, actually, there are two reasons. Noodles and uh, Demon Hunting. That's it. Those are the two reasons. I would highly recommend that you watch it just for those two things. They make some wonderful noodles and while they're making some wonderful noodles, they you know, kind of beat up demons for a, you know, for fun. Just that. And that is why I would recommend that you watch this show. Imagine this, okay? You have a nice little noodle eating spot, noodle restaurant called Annie's Noodle. And that serves as a headquarter for a demon hunting group. That is is essentially what it is. And that is something I call spectacular takeout. Do you get the joke? Please don't unsubscribe. Please. It was worth the shot, right? Like, take out it was right there anyway let's get into why uncanny counter is so much fun first of all okay is it predictable definitely 100 percent. but here's the thing right it's a very unique take on good versus evil you have a bunch of good guys you have like gomotak somona and then i keep forgetting their names i i, I can recall their faces but i can't rename them you have four main characters in the first season and then you have five in the second season and yeah there are two seasons to this and it was so much fun the comedy in the show like the jokes that they have and the relationship they build with each other the relationship they build with you why why would i recommend a k-drama first of all i kind of ran out of tv shows to watch i didn't know what to watch so i started watching it and then I had fun watching it so I watched the second season as well and I can tell you one thing for sure the plot is very interesting so they're dealing with a lot of social issues as well kind of politicians good versus evil what happens when something goes wrong in a person's life and they they're also dealing with a lot of supernatural elements in the whole show but how that has been set up is not unrealistic and the fact that they can talk about all of it with each other but not everybody else also plays a very important part into what the show is the concept of the heaven and hell is described in this show is unique like Every K-drama that I watched essentially has a very unique take on what they think would heaven look like, what they think hell would look like. And that unique take is essentially why I would recommend this show to watch it just for how unique the premise is. It's more demon hunting than ghost hunting and it's not scary. Well, I can't call conjuring scary. It's just bad visual effects with awful music so i wouldn't call that like more it's not a horror show at the end of it it's a comedy it's a drama and it's a lot of things that well a k-drama generally is the thing about the show is it it's very well written the premise is set up very beautifully you have these four characters who've come together to save the world from all these demons that are possessing different people who are doing bad things killing people robbing people and essentially as you move along in the show you kind of understand the characters a little more and how they connect with each other the whole cast comes together to deliver this performance that makes you understand why the show is so different great performances a unique premise good characters actual character arcs from the beginning to the end great cinematography and editing and the usual over-the-top k-drama-ness of the tv show makes what this show is if you have the time to watch this show if you can spare like 20 hours to watch this show i'm pretty sure you'll be able to watch it over one weekend and get done with it and you and the thing is you will watch it over one weekend i wouldn't be surprised if you finish watching the whole thing over one weekend because that's how gripping the story is i'm not gonna divulge too much information about what the story is because i do want you to go watch the show and tell me what you felt about the show would you like me to recommend more shows like this because i've got a few that i have in mind so do leave a comment down below if you'd like more recommendations like this and hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, share it with your friends and peace. That's been my time and see you in the next one.